Hello, thank you for joining me. I'm out in the pleasant countryside today. You've probably gathered where I might be going. You've just heard a whistle. We're near the village of Shenton. It's the first transport to come to the village. What's the Aspie de Lazuch Canal? Just over there now. The towpath is on that side of the canal, so can't walk along the towpath. However, I'm on Station Road, which comes from the village. The village is that way. And we're going to go to a railway station. Now you already know, going by the sound of the whistle at the beginning of the video, that we're at Heritage Railway. Today we've come to the Battlefield Railway. It's a railway I've always wanted to go to, and today they've got a Hall class locomotive running, number 6989, Whittick or Whitewick Hall. I have had this loco for haulage before. She was at Quainton most of 2019, where she was restored. I thought it'd be nice to have her now on a bit of a longer section of track. I mean, I do really like Quainton, the Buckinghamshire Railway Centre, um, but it's more of a day out to see lots of different locos rather than go for long train rides. So here we are. We're just coming up the stations there in front of us. It sounds like the train is going to go soon, so I'm going to have to buy my ticket and get on the two o'clock departure for a run up the line to Shenton. Now, the reason the railway is called the Battlefield Railway is because it runs near where the Battle of Bosworth happened all those years ago. That's a plan for another day. I think I'm going to come to this area one day and just go for a nice walk and we'll go and find the field of the Battle of Bosworth. But today, we're going to move up to the railway. It's a very nice station building. You can see the smoke in the steam in the distance. The smoke and steam, the steam over. Very attractive station building. I'm going to go in through those doors and um, we're going to go and have our train ride behind Whitewick Hall. Probably unusual for a Great Western loco. They probably wouldn't really have come here in steam days, but still, it's um, it's nice. That's how preservation is. You get all sorts of unusual locos turning up in different places. So here we go into the booking hall. It's quite a nice big room, and um, should buy my and ticket from there in a moment. Make sure you're on the three thirty train. Uh, and I'm just going to go out here onto the platform. This is nice. It's like. The Food smells nice as well. And then we should wander up here. We can see our train, so it has to be fairly quick. I've got to buy my ticket and we, I'm going to get on this one, but they're watering at the moment, so I've got about 10 minutes before the train goes. I'll show you the loco that we're going to travel behind. to the viewing area. I think we'll do that afterwards. Let's have a look at the logo first. Okay. Yeah, that's nice. Well, I go and buy my ticket and have a train ride. So after a very enjoyable trip through the countryside, we've now arrived at Shenton. The hall has just ran round her train, so she's just up there waiting to couple to the carriage to take us back to Shakerston. The railway once carried on that way in the direction of Nuneaton. Maybe one day they'll reopen it and connect it up to the main line, that'd be nice, and run excursions off the national network to here. I just want to show you one thing. This is a this car park is mainly for people going to visit the site of the Battle of Bosworth. What they've done is quite nice, they've got a toilet block in the style of a railway station, even though, um, well, you can see there's a waiting shelter just up there, no longer part of the railway, and the old station ticket office is just over there. So we're gonna have a look at that in a minute. So quite an attractive building, really, for toilet block and built to look like 
a railway station. So as for the Battle of Bosworth, which um, I'm sure you know many of you have heard of, famous time in Tudor history, that battle took place just over the fields over there. So we're not actually going to go there on this video because I haven't really got time. Um, but we will go there in the next video. Stephanie and Frank Coming Soloco is up there, coupling to the carriages, so you can see where the line ends. So as you, and it's a footpath now in that direction. So perhaps one day we'll come here on foot and we'll walk along the old railway and have a look at that. So I'm going to show you the that's the station building. And um, oh, one other thing I'll have to show you because we're here is um, we have battle hat because of course we're near the Battle of Bosworth. If you look it's not far away. Two kings one day. Battle no, Bosworth Battlefield Heritage Centre. So it's 15 minutes walk away. So I think that's something we might come and do another time. We could come here on the train and go there but I'm not sure when. Here's the station building. So half of it is the ticket office. The other half is the glass making. We actually make glass which is um, quite an interesting use for an old station. We can have a quick look. So this is all the glass on sale, which they've made. And if you look behind me, you can see. See the glass kilns over there. There's too much about glass making. It looks very interesting. I'm now going to go and get back on the train and travel back to Shakespeare. Before I get on the train, one thing I just want to tell you, this station building, I just went and had a look inside. It came from Humberston Road in Leicester, so they actually dismantled the station, which is quite common on Harrison Railways. They dismantled the whole station building and rebuilt it here at Shenton.
now at Market Bosworth station. I got out here on my second round trip rather than go all the way to Shenton again just so I could film the loco depart which of course I will put those shots in because it, she looked really good as she pulled out of here. She made a lot of noise. We just heard her whistle then. So I've got a bit of time here while the loco and the train goes to Shenton and back and of course it means it's another station I've visited. Now this one's quite interesting. At Shenton I said about how the station building came from Leicester Humberston Road. Well, what's happened here? The station building is intact, but it's now um, appears to be a garage where they sell cars. So the station building's over there, and they've got a platform just on this side. So it's not there is no, it's not quite a passing loop. If you look up there, the track's not connected. So they've got a siding, and um, it's purely a siding. So trains can't pass here. Here's a little tea room. It's closed now because this will be the last train back to Shenton. If we just have a wander up here, I'll show you the old Market Bosworth station building. The town Market Bosworth is about half a mile or so in, in that direction. So behind all these wagons, there we have the old Market Bosworth station building, very similar to the one at Shakerston. So um, there's also a big car park, there's a good city camp park here. 
thing I quite like is nothing to do with the railway. It's an old uh, Sierra State park there on the platform. So um, after now I've got away from my train. Wondering about gradients, it's only 440 towards Shenton and at the moment it's level towards Shakerston but the gradient does vary slightly in both ways. So here we are from um, Market Boswell Station. I'm now going to wait for my train back to Shakerston. So here we are, we're back at Shakerston. It's dusk now. We've had a couple of round trips up and down Battlefield Line, had a great afternoon. So if you ever are in the Midlands area, then do call in and visit the Battlefield Railway, have a trip up and down. It's a great railway, interesting ride. And if you have a bit more time, you could go and see the site of the Battle of Bosworth, which I'm gonna come and do at some point in the future. So thank you very much for watching and thank you to the Battlefield Line for a great afternoon and um, please do feel free to like, subscribe, tell your friends etc. Thank you very much for watching, goodbye.